Good morning, Hoover Math and Science Academy st students and staff. Hi, this is Izzy coming to you live from the WHVR studio. <coughs> Today is Tuesday, November 10th, 2015. The temperature in the village of Schomburg is currently 37 degrees. We are expecting a high of 55 and a low of 36, with partly sunny skies. Now please stand and join us in saying our nation's pledge. Our pledge people for today are Zahasra Mark I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation under God indivisible with liberty and justice for all. In sports, the Bears won last night against the San Diego Chargers with a score of 22 to 19. And the Chicago Bulls won against the Philadelphia, Philadelphia 76ers by a score of 111 to 88. Clubs meeting today are the Green Film Club Group A in room 112 at 1120. PBIS Ambassadors in the Music Room at 1145. iPad Club at 11 o'clock in room 106. Sixth grade first Lego League in room 208 at 3 o'clock. Lego Robotics section 3 in room in the library at, 11, at 315. Fourth grade photo club in, art, in the art studio at 3 o'clock. And tomorrow morning, chess club will meet at 745 in the library. We are looking for... We are looking for 5th and 6th grade students to volunteer December 7th from 3 o'clock to 4.30. Students will meet in the, be meeting in the main hallway to wrap presents with the Schomburg Fire Department. Turn in per permission forms to Mrs. Lakowski in room 121. Here's today's interesting fact. Did you know how hot air balloons work? The large, the large balloon on the top is called an envelope. It holds hot air created by a heat source known as a burner. The burner creates an open flame by burning a mix of liquid propane and air. Hot air balloons rise because the hot air inside the envelope is, la is lighter than the cold air outside. Passengers trip typically stand in a wicker basket beneath the envelope. While most envelopes have a standard balloon shape, some are designed to look like animals, cartoon characters, and other fun objects. That's all for today. This week's pre-broadcast pictures and sign-offs are brought to you by third graders in room 121. Have a turkey-filled Tuesday.